St. John and Maxville, Kansas, on Cable Channel 3, and Sandy Land Center of the Iowa Lord God website. Today is Friday, the 15th of May, and it's 72 here in the square, and it's cloudy, but we're not getting much rain. Uh, the forecast for today is for rain. 81, the high temperature, and a 40% chance of rain. Now, Saturday is a potential thunderstorm with 72, the high temperature, and an 80% chance of rain. Then, Sunday and Monday are both sunny. 80 on Sunday, 69 on Monday. And then, back to the wet weather, Tuesday rain, 64, the high temperature with a 60% chance of rain. And Wednesday, thunderstorms, 63, the high with a 30% chance of, of rain. We just have a, a few birthdays, and they're both uh, friends with each other. Brett Slob and Brett Slob, happy birthday today. And they're the only ones for this weekend. <coughs> Now, as we look for direct commission uh, trips, uh, May 21st, which is a Thursday, the lunch bunch is going to learn it, and they leave at 10.30, come back at 2.30. And then on Thursday the 28th, they're going to the Kansas Star Casino in Mulvane, and they leave at 8 and come back at 4.00. And then we're getting ready for the Jubilee, uh, this coming up. Uh, so Friday, May 22nd, is the beginning. And it starts off at 5 with various things, uh, the Hood Technatorium. Things that most people are interested in are 6.15 to 7.30 Friday is the barbecue supper in the park. And 6 o'clock to midnight is the carnival, and that's what most of the young people are interested in. And then there are other things too, like a beer garden and a street dance. Uh, but most of the seniors probably won't go to the street dance. Um, so then on uh, Saturday, <coughs> We have the skydive, and uh, it just doesn't give times, but uh, it says skydive atlas, demos and tandem jumps through the day. So you can skydive and have a skilled uh, skydiver attached to you, and that way you're sure that they will open the ripcord and so on. That's new. I don't think we've ever done that here in uh, St. John. But in the morning on Saturday from 7 to 10, I know a big hit is always the IOF Lodge free breakfast at the Shell Center. And that's from 7 to 10. And then there are the Jubilee runs from 8 to 10. And the Lions, this time, this is another new one, I think. The Lions Site Foundation Mobile Screening Unit will be here from 9 until 1, and they do mostly eye tests. Uh, so you might want to check and see, because sometimes as you get older, your eyes deteriorate, but slowly enough so that you don't see it. Uh, and that's literally, you don't see it. Okay, well, anyway, after that uh, is uh, the parade, and let's see, that is, it's here, I know it's here, I can't see it. Huh, I think it's at one thirty for the parade, and let's see, then at uh, Yep, 1.30 the parade, and the carnival is from 10 to 5, and that's always an important thing for the young people. And then in the afternoon, uh, there are the prize drawings, and you can go and sign up for a free ticket, but you can also buy a button, 
and they have a special uh, drawing for the buttons that are numbered, and that starts at 4.10 in the afternoon. And then the closing uh, Boy Scout uh, pack, I guess it's Cub Scouts, are uh, closing at uh, 5 o'clock to 5.15. Then there's a reunion, uh, the alumni reunion from 6.30 to 9 for those who are alumni that come back. All right, then we're left with the menus. And so over at the VIP Center in Maxville, the Senior Fellowship Meal, they're having a deli sandwich today. Mexican chicken and green beans on Monday, tuna salad and deli fixings on Tuesday, and ham and beans or stew on Wednesday. Over here at the Sunflower Center, they're having minestrone soup today. On uh, Monday, pork chop supreme and uh, parsley noodles. And then chicken and noodles Tuesday. Uh, and on Wednesday, chicken strips and fried potatoes. And that's all the news and announcements we have for you at this time. Uh, the word of the day is this. The biggest difficulty with today is that our knowledge has increased so fast that it's gotten way beyond our wisdom. This is Jim Lakey, hoping you have a really nice weekend and stay out of the thunderstorm.